Hey Beaver Nation, my name is Cheyenne Lever and I'm here at the Corvallis Boxing Club, your boxing club at Oregon State with head coach Dan Dunn. Could you tell our viewers about how you got started in boxing? Sure, when I was, uh, when I was young I had a serious temper issue and uh, I had uh, gotten fights at school a lot. So one day one of the boxers at the local boxing club where I was at said, hey, you need to come with me and they took me to the boxing gym and that's how I got started. So what made you decide to start a boxing club here in Corvallis? I wanted to kind of try to reinvigorate boxing back into collegiate boxing because it used to be an NCAA sport, it's not anymore, and we wanted to um, try to bring it back. What I try to instill is, is confidence, try to help people, you know, see beyond what's in front of their face a little bit so they can have a little more courage in life. That's really what we're trying to get done here. It's, it's a leadership mentoring kind of program so people can strengthen their own perspective. We as a whole, as a whole club itself, want to become a sponsored student organization. And what that means is like right now, you have to say that long script of for the Corvallis Boxing Club, the Boxing Club of, of Oregon State, right? Mm -hmm. We want to be able to say OSU Boxing, but until we're a sponsor club, we can't say that. And uh, it would be nice to go out and represent Oregon State in name, not just in colors. Along with getting in great shape, that's going to happen no matter what. They're going to learn self-confidence. So they're going to learn to box. They'll learn not to get overly excited about things. They'll learn to, to deal with conflict in a constructive way without having to text their way out of a problem because that's a real problem nowadays. The Corvallis Boxing Club practices Monday through Thursday from 6 to 8 p.m. at Life Community Church. You can contact them through Facebook by searching the Corvallis Boxing Club or Boxing Club at Oregon State. This has been Cheyenne Lever reporting for Beaver News.